Hey, Pro Source team, checking out 1601 Cedar Lane, right here. Kind of a busy street, but ducked off a little bit. So this is a uh, was a new build that was never finished. So no driveway ever put in. Good sized lot. Uh, no real exterior issues outside of a tree hitting the back side of the house, um, causing a roof leak there. And we'll see. We'll see what was happening there once we go inside. But as you can see, good sized house. You can see that something happened with mortar color. That's not an issue we would address. Uh, outside unit has not been put here for the heat and air. Same inside, the unit has been hooked up to ductwork, but not actually piped in. So you walk in here, first small bedroom. New floors just never never been finished, just dirty. Small hall closet. Another bedroom. Good sized closets. Laundry. It's a good sized laundry room. Not super crazy about the tile choices, but we will have to live with it. Hall bath. Two bay garage or a double wide garage. One of the issues you see right off the bat is there was obviously some kind of disagreement on something, somebody's part. So somebody wasn't happy. Uh, can't see with that plumbing is a mess right there. Not exactly sure what's going on, why it's run that way. But a good size utility closet that runs under the stairs for the Upstairs bonus room. We'll walk through the living room here to the master. Again, good sized bedroom. High ceiling. Into the ensuite. Cabinets are the same throughout, kitchen and everything. Again, not choices we would make ourselves, but we will most likely have to stay with these. Water closet, always nice. And then a good sized master closet. I think that's around six by seven, good size. And then here in the living room, that is where that tree came down. You can see that. It's got a fireplace. And then the unfinished kitchen. All right, and then we'll check out upstairs bonus room. So it's a really good sized bonus room up here. It already has a half bath, so it could very easily be turned into a foot bath for a bedroom, excuse me. Uh, 
<clears throat> so as far as we can tell, all of our wiring has been pulled. Um, so outside of the issue with the wire being cut off at the panel, we are not seeing any other electrical issues as of right now. But yeah, I'll just take another quick walk around the back side of the house. Maybe have to deal with a tree or two. Here's a back porch off of the living room, kitchen. And you can see right there is where the tree hit. That's our issue with that leak there. Nice little jungle back here. Just some lot clearing would go a long way here. All right, this is 1601. Cedar Lane.